Indian agriculture is facing formidable challenges, which need to be addressed urgently, keeping in view the fast-changing climate. Genome editing provides sustainable solutions, and needs to be effectively used for introducing climate resilience in the newly developed crop varieties, while maintaining their high yield potential. For harnessing the full potential of new plant breeding technologies, India has adopted science-based regulations and has recently announced exemptions of genome edited crops from biosafety assessment for the benefit of farmers. With this positive development, India is poised well for the next revolution in agriculture through the use of genome editing tools for crop improvement. Gene editing technology is a game changer, which has the potential to revolutionize agriculture in terms of improved production, improved productivity, improved nutritional status. And today, we have a lot of research which is going on. Priority crops that we need to focus on are oil seeds, vegetables, pulses, fruits. We also have now a very well-structured regulatory framework which is giving a special impetus to the researchers from industry, academia and the startups and giving them an opportunity to be able to take their research through translation to improved and excellent products for the market. The recent policy guidelines declared by the Government of India on genome editing in plants has encouraged product developers in this area. Companies with know-how and skills to utilize these technologies can bring products to the market effectively. The opportunities are many. Climate resilient crops, pest and disease tolerance, plants that have increased yield and productivity due to changing their architecture. All these are possible and will make India globally competitive. India needs to increase oilseed production to cut down on our edible oil imports which are running into thousands of crores of rupees annually. There is a lot of scope for improving oilseed crops like soybean, mustard and groundnut for disease resistance and nutritional enhancement using gene editing. Gene editing, it enables de novo domestication of nutrition superior and climate resilient wild relatives across species at a much faster pace, thus enabling their production and sustainability in agriculture. The exemptions are in line with the global assessments that a trait will not be regulated if there is no foreign DNA. It's especially benefit for small seed companies in India to develop trades for local needs. It's an opportunity for India to be a hub for global seed production, for seed movement and trade. Genome editing has a tremendous potential in breaking yield ceiling, enhancing climate resilience, and improving nutritional quality in crops. Realizing its potential, Government of India initiated work in this area five, six years ago. Several institutions of the country are already working in various crops. With the right kind of policy of the Government of India in place, I strongly believe that in another two, three years' time, the fast genome-edited crop variety should be there in the field.